In this video, we are going to show you how to make money on Facebook. Before we start, I am Lee Wilcox, co-founder and CEO of Electric House. The geezer here, this geezer. I'm Adam Barry, uh, I'm the co-founder, creative director at Electric House. We are a social media publishing group and please do subscribe to us and if at any point you're enjoying the video, let's give us a little a little like to uh, stroke our egos. This video is going to be a step-by-step -step system and points on how you can make money on Facebook. We run a company called Electric House, uh, turns over millions and millions of pounds each year and predominantly our money is made through that platform that Mark Zuckerberg loves to push the buttons up and down on, Facebook. Without further ado, all that shit out of the way, let's jump in. Right, let's get into it. So the first one I want to talk about is in-stream ads. What are in-stream ads? That's right, you've guessed it. They're those annoying little adverts that pop up after about a minute when you've been watching content on Facebook. We've all had them, we've been watching a video, and all of a sudden an advert pops up and you just And how do they work? Well, if you're a creator like we are, we get to place adverts in our content from advertisers and we get to keep 55% of the revenue from that and Facebook keep the other 45. Now, not everyone can get them. There are a few small hoops you have to jump through, like you have to have at least 10,000 followers on your Facebook page and you also have to have 30,000 one minute views within a 60 day period, but that's 30,000 one minute views on three minute content or more. You also have to be in an eligible country as well, so not every country has them. So how do you use Facebook in-stream ads? Well, your content has to be a minimum of three minutes long to place an advert in there. Now they have started to roll out one minute uh, videos where you can place ads in, but the CPMs aren't that great and neither are the earnings. So I'd stick to three minute content and it allows you to place an advert one minute into that video. So 60 seconds in, you can place an advert. And to see how much money you're making off your adverts, you just need to go to Creator Studio and look through your insights. And in there, they've got a pretty good setup where you can look through your earnings. Creator Studio is actually pretty good to look at the data that you know, anyone without sort of a data brain can understand. You can start looking at your videos uh, and breaking those down and seeing what's worked and why. We'll probably go into that into another video, but this isn't the one. If you've got any questions on in-stream ads, don't forget, stick it in the comments now. Uh, over to Lee. Another way to make money on Facebook, branded content. Branded content is when a brand works with a publisher or Facebook page or, or group and creates content and pushes it through that channel. God, we've done hundreds of bits of content now with brands, more notably, and I guess most famously, our direct line for business one, um, 34 million views in, in 48 hours. So there's three ways in which we split our branded content down. So we have ad hoc or campaign, um, which is uh, when a brand will come and they'll give us a brief or we'll pitch an idea at them and they'll go, yeah, that's great. And we will get, say, three months work or we'll get one campaign that covers a three month period. Then we have retained. And this is where you'll get paid monthly or quarterly, but you'll have a set amount of content that you're creating for them all the time. This is how it works for us. Having those retained partnerships, what it really allows you to do is, is plan, like plan to, get more clients or plan to employ more people. You can really see where you're at as a business. Um, and I think it's super important to be able to have those uh, retained partnerships to be able to plan. So branded content, great way of making money on, on Facebook. And the primary way that we make money on Facebook is through branded content. Definitely big fan, big, big fan. The next one I want to talk about is Facebook groups. Now, Facebook groups historically have been quite difficult to make money through because they're closed and Facebook don't offer any services uh, to make money through Facebook groups. Now, they're getting a little bit better at that, so they've started to realize so many people use Facebook groups 
Facebook want a piece of the pie, of course they do. So they're allowing people that own groups uh, certain ways to make money. So I'm gonna run you through a couple of ways that we make money from our groups. And because Facebook are pushing them so much, sorry, I've got an itchy elbow. And because Facebook are pushing them so much, it's putting them in people's feeds. There's even tabs now to view groups and I keep getting notifications even over this last week saying explore groups easy here. So when, when you see that on Facebook apps, you know it's a big part of their plans. One of the first things we do is we partner with brands. So what this is, it's a way that Facebook allow us to allow a brand to become a member of our group. So what we do is we charge that brand a retainer per month and, and there's like three tiers of payment there depending on how much activity they can actually do within the group because the last thing you want is a brand coming in and just spamming all your members because they're gonna get really annoyed with that and they're probably gonna leave. If you've got a cooking group and someone's asking uh, where to get the best pans from and you've got a company that supplies pans, then they can search for the keywords in the group and then start engaging within that content and hopefully for them sell some products in it's a winner for the group member because they're actually looking for that value and that advice and it's a winner for the brand too so that's another way we make money through facebook groups social commerce big fan of ecom but ecom through social so facebook have done lots and lots of updates recently on building online stores and selling through facebook more notably they're ready to launch um, so I've just been watching this video and realised that the lighting on it, have you seen my glasses? But I thought I'll film this and we can chuck it in the video to so just apologise for my poor shitty lighting. The irony, it's not dealt with because I was filming by a window again and you can still see the shine in my glasses. I mean, I need some help. They're ready to launch um, shopping through lives. They've integrated a much better shopping experience into uh, Facebook, which crosses over to Instagram as well. You know, the point is Facebook as a platform, really big push for, for commerce. Zuckerberg's must be so rich, must not he? Must be so rich, man. So first way, and, and actually the first way we made money on social media was through selling merch. We have funny slogans, t-shirts, hoodies, mugs. So when you build a community on, on Facebook, tell them something because they will buy from your brand if you've built a community and if it's an engaged community you can even reach out to them particularly if you've got facebook groups you can reach out try and gauge what people might want to buy you know um, and then build that from there look at what community you've got what their interests are uh, maybe what sector they're in if it's uh, something that's more business related um, and then look at the brands that you could partner with from a branded partner partnership perspective, so from a content creation, and then go, okay, let's try and find a load of brands that sell products that our community would be interested in buying. And then you try and partner with them in that way. So you can create your own store, sell their products through your store, or you can do it where you're just creating content and driving ads through your Facebook pages and groups to sell product from their website. Um, there's trackable, um, UTM links that can work from a, a shoppable perspective so that you don't lose out on any of the revenue and you can get a cut of that revenue. Get your social commerce, sling it up and go on, get on with it. I'm so caught with this, but it stops when I press it. And the last one from me, the penultimate one of the video is affiliate marketing. Again, if you're not familiar with what affiliate marketing is, it's when you can post the links to third party sites and then when someone purchases via that link, you can make some money. So we've done this in the past. Now the downfall is the percentages and the margins are really, really low. So you have to get a lot of sales on these affiliate links to make good money. But if you've got a huge following, then uh, it shouldn't be a problem. But if you haven't, I wouldn't really start with affiliate links. I'd try and go direct to brand because you're definitely gonna get a better deal. So there's third party sites like Awin that allow you to look at their website and you can choose so many different categories and see what fits your group. You can then post those products or those discounts into the group and when people purchase through them, you're gonna make a cut of the money. However, a lot of these sites do have really short periods of time for you to actually, for someone to actually buy via that link and I've seen um, sales generated into the hundreds of thousands but 
you've only earned like a few thousand pound from it because the people have gone on to order that uh, product after a certain time frame, which is quite scandalous really. But it is another way, if you can get a big audience uh, and you can get a lot of people buying that product, then it's a really good way to make money. Um, but you have to look at the sort of like the higher ticket priced items because again, percentage will stay the same. However, you'll just earn more money because they're high ticket priced items. So hopefully that helps. Lee, over to you. My last point to make money on Facebook is instant articles. There's not many um, communities that start off by using this because it's a, a harder thing to integrate. However, if you are already driving traffic as part of your monetization on Facebook and you're driving traffic to a, a website already, you need to be using instant articles. So instant articles, imagine it as an extension of your current website, except for Facebook like it. So as we all know, if you're already driving traffic away from Facebook, they don't like it. Gone are the years where we had lots and lots of uh, free traffic to websites. You know, it's much harder now, you pay to play. I'm not gonna go through how to place those into articles on, on this episode, but we will do another video on how to integrate that further down the line. We'll leave a note um, in the description of what you need to do in order to set them up. But once they're set up, there's a couple of different ways you can do it. So you can use their audience network, which is the easiest way uh, to make money through instant articles. You can manually place your own ads um, through uh, an ad stack that you've got within your um, within your website. And also you can do branded content through there as well. So the branded content strategy that you've got with your brands and partners, you can also, also utilize that as a uh, means to distribute more content. The key thing about this is that your reach and viewership and time on the platform will be higher. Facebook give you more reach on, on those instant articles, it's a fact, you know, and it's because it's within their interest to do that. They take a cut of the um, ads that are placed in those articles and therefore it's a benefit for them. So uh, my third point on making money on Facebook is Facebook instant articles, baby. There you have it, six points on, um, on making money on Facebook. Be sure to check the next video out. So if you've got some value from this, you're definitely gonna get it from the next one because it's all about how we make money on in-stream ads. Uh, in particular, how we made 70K on uh, one video. Till then, uh, we've got videos on how to operate your budget, um, to check that out, a 2021 plan for uh, building out your P&L and your budget. Um, and be sure to watch the weekly vlog, The Bowl, uh, where you can see us running a seven million quid business from our households at the minute because we're on lockdown, isn't it? If you like the video, please don't forget to show some love and subscribe, like, and even leave a comment if you can be bothered. We'll be back soon with another video. See you on the next one.